it, one of the challenges we've been seeing, especially with the small FSM small grants uh, projects, uh, it, it's the capacity to write grants, uh, proposals, and, and and writing the report. So it, it's really directing towards the writing uh, aspect. And, and it's something that is a challenge, I think, in, in all most Micronesian regions. So um, with the USAID uh, Climate Ready Program, it, it, it really helped uh, uh, build uh, that technical capacity in, in, in at least building the, uh, the skills of uh, the community proponents in, in writing their proposals and clarifying, you know, their activities in a way that, you know, it can be understandable in, 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 in the broader level. Yeah? Now our, all the houses in our community, they're happy because they have water from the morning all the way during the night and also in the morning. If there's like long uh, drought this uh, season, we still have water since we already have this project from you and also we connect it to our this big tank in our community. So now we're very thankful for all the support or all the help you gave us in our community. As far as resilience, um, we're teaching our community members, uh, um, you know, the, the, the basic capacity uh, to, to help them, uh, you know, reach out to their resources, help them care for them, help them nurture it, and at the same time, you know, um, you know, produce some sort of income from it. You know, giving them that access, uh, giving them ideas on how, how to do it. You know, uh, there's wealth of knowledge out there. It's not necessarily accessible to these communities. With, uh, with folks like uh, USAID, Climate Ready, you know, uh, we're able to see those options, see those ideas, and integrate, it, integrate them to how, you know, uh, you know, communities can build their own resilience, uh, you know, uh, actions. Um, for SMKs, um, you know, largely around our marine protected area, um, we're building communities, using that as the MPAs as a bellwether, um, and just indicating, you know, how, if, how climate change is affecting uh, our communities. And from that, learning from that, we're uh, building our resiliences towards uh, climate change.